video. Okay, guys, take it away. Hi, uh, I'm Mike Glavin at City Floor Supply, and we're standing here in the shop. Uh, we're going to do our first live feed showing a, a repair at a, with a B2 edger uh, and replacing uh, the B2 edger switch. Angelo's going to uh, do the work, and I'm just going to uh, talk through uh, what he's doing. So, Angelo, take it away. First, Angelo is going to take off the uh, uh, the dust pipe su support here, uh, so he gets easy access to the handle. After taking off those four bolts, you'll see the dust pipe is. Uh, uh, is off and then uh, now he's going to work at loosening the handle uh, in order to replace the switch on a B2 edger you got it because uh, the switch is in the handle so you, you got to take the uh, the handle off See Angelo staying very organized, putting all the uh, uh, the bolts there. He's using his 9 16 wrench there to loosen uh, the bolt that's you know holding the switch tight onto the housing. Now he's got the switch loose. He's going to feed it through, pull it out, and you can see that almost the crow's nest of wires in there, and they all have a purpose. So, uh, staying right with it. Angelo's going to loosen the leads here. That's the uh, for the light, right, Angela? This is the light. The, the leads is, for the light. And this yep. is the power. And the power. And these two leads go to the field. And yeah, and then each of those two leads that he's loosening now are what's going to go to the uh, field. And obviously, when it's in the oin position, uh, you know, the field will get electric. So he's got all of the uh, leads off, and now the new switch. And now reassemble it. Putting the leads for the uh, for the power and the light together. Adding those. onto the front side of the switch. And getting the second wire set on there to complete the circuit for the light and get the power to the switch. Both of those are now you know, firmly fastened on. And then getting the leads for the field. Notice when Angelo started with the switch, he just made sure he knew which side to put the uh, the light and power on, and easy enough. But just you know, you want to make sure that you have the switch uh, 
oriented correctly. And on go the leads. For the windings. getting the switch placed back into the housing. He's just going to wrap with some electrical tape just around each of the leads just to make sure that nothing is ever going to touch. That's just a precautionary step that we always do here in the shop and highly recommend. You'll note it's tight going in there, but it all works, fits together. Put on the little washer, uh, which also gives you an orientation and then lock it down. We're just going to seat it back into its original location and attach it. With the bolts we took out previously. Back on the, the dust pipe support. As you note there, he's just making sure that that gasket is um, brought right along with the support. You don't want to forget any pieces. Tighten it up. Good job, Angelo. All right. 
and the edger switch for the B2 is replaced. Simple as that. Thank you for watching.